Now this is a, a shot taken from the staircase from the main floor up to the top floor, uh, panning through the kitchen. As a videographer walks up the stairs, uh, you can see these uh, railings on both sides of an area in the apartment we refer to as the bridge. The bridge is over top of the kitchen, separating or attaching the front and the back of the building. Looking through over the building on one side, we look down to the dining room table. And now right ahead of you on the front of the bridge is the front bedroom here. The front bedroom is again, it's vaulted, it has a ceiling fan uh, in the top. There are several lighting options. There are two large closets in this master bedroom which have these bifold doors that go in. Again, all the closets in this apartment are lit. This, uh, this, these closets have got a good size to them. There are two of them here. In front of you is a rather unique feature in this apartment. There is a fold down step here. This window becomes a door. You can walk out the door onto the balcony. There's just enough room out here for a small table and chairs. And the balcony overlooks the front of the apartment looking up and down onto College Avenue and a rather blustery winter day. Coming back into the apartment Coming back into the apartment, you can walk down those two steps. And with a couple of quick tricks here, we can turn around and close the door, flip up the stairs, and we're back to a bay window in the master or in the front bedroom. There is also a, an attic storage in this apartment, which does take a step ladder to get to, but there is some space up there. There is a skylight in this room. It is one of uh, a total of actually nine skylights in this apartment. There's a rather unique rolling door to this bedroom that is a door catching a door, so it's a double door. You can close this off or it will leave it completely open to the balcony. And the door, I'm afraid, is a little nervous for the camera. So if the cameraman comes on through here, You'll see that this balcony is open to the other side to a third bathroom as well as a laundry room. You go down three steps and tucked inside the roof here is a small bath bathroom to your left that's uh, very well appointed medicine cabinet, um, a nice clean vanity and bath with a rather unique shower curtain because of the angle of the roof. There's a small window in here as well as a skylight overhead. This bathroom actually is closed with a pocket door as is the pocket door on the opposite side of this hallway which opens into a laundry room. There's a washer and dryer here, a sink and plenty of storage underneath. Um, at the back of this hall is the master bedroom, the largest bedroom that uh, we were in previously when we came up the back staircase. Walking right through both of this bathroom and this laundry room as well as the other two bathrooms in this apartment are all vented to the outside. Uh, walking back into the master bedroom at the encouragement of our cameraman we're going to walk upstairs and onto the balcony and onto the roof. Before. So. Anyhow, we can back up here, up the spiral staircase. I've, all, I've already lowered the staircase down, so I can just continue to walk straight on up the staircase where I'm going to open the hatch and come up onto the top. Up the hatch out onto the balcony. The balcony is only about eight by nine foot, but there's an interesting and rather beautiful panoramic view.
perspective of Shady starting at Shady Side. Have it. There's the staircase back down into the warm.